The truth about stars. We've been lied to our entire lives. What are the odds that they removed certain books from the Bible that spoke about what stars actually are? Learn the truth once and for all. By the way, follow me on Twitter at Fire of Truth 11. Therefore, having heard this, this glorified the Lord God. And again, I questioned the demons, saying, Tell me how you can ascend into heaven, being demons, and amidst the stars and the holy angels intermingle. And he answered, Just as things are fulfilled in heaven, so also on earth are fulfilled the types of all of them. For there are principalities, authorities, world rulers, and we demons fly about in the air, and we hear the voices of the heavenly beings and survey all powers as having no ground or basis on which to alight and rest we lose strength and fall off like leaves from trees and men seeing us imagine that the stars are falling from heaven but it is not really so king but we fall because of our weakness and because we have nowhere anything to lay hold of and so we fall down like lightning in the depth of night and suddenly and we set cities in flames and fires of fields for the stars have firm foundations in the heaven like the sun and the moon now did you pay attention what that said right there for the stars have firm foundations in the heaven like the sun and moon which means they can't fall they are firmly put there for eternity stars do not fall demons fall and i just showed you that in scripture it's really really simple you're being lied to about your whole reality and i'm trying to teach you the real reality it's time to wake up and quit believing these lies that these people have been feeding to you for centuries now and what you got to ask yourself is why all the books that were stripped from the bible are the books that explain to us everything that's going on in the sky and what all these things are made and how they were made and ain't it funny that all those are stripped from the Bible and the only information you are given about everything up in the sky and all around you now is given to you by NASA? Hmm. These are not fallen stars. These are the demons, the evil spirits bound here for eternity until a judgment day. Stars are angels, just as scripture of Enoch says. And that is why it's called a falling star. And they even hide it in the intro of Paramount movies, The Fallen Angels Descending on Mount Hermon. The Book of Enoch, Chapter 6. And the angels, the children of the heaven, and there were in all...